action. Making a cappuccino for YouTube. Take one. Hopefully that'll be it. So, how's it going guys? Welcome back to a brand new video. I'm going to try something different today. We're making a cappuccino. First of all, I'm going to start by draining the machine. That is a, a steel thingy I use to froth milk. I'm just using like the bigger one of the two to drain. I've got the other one chilling in the fridge because that's what I've been taught. Obviously, don't want to <laughs> use the hot, bloody gross steel thing for the milk, that would just be wrong. Alright, so I'm... Here we go, just grinding some beans. I've got the, like, the audio track fairly low, so I don't think you'll be able to hear this when it's published. Just give it a quick tap to redistribute, because the little grinder likes to, like... Like, it spits it out all down, like, the top end, and yeah, just tap it down. Showing off for the camera a bit there. <laughs> Make sure it's nice and firm, obviously, but too firm and you'll bugger the machine, so don't do that. And then press it in firmly. And I'm just trying to find a mug to use. I use my bicycle mug because it's right there. <laughs> Got the milk in the tin now, ready to froth just gonna like do it step by step so hopefully that'll be easy enough for you guys to follow understand too that I'm still new to this all right so espresso's done I take the group head out straight away just because that's how I do it at home I don't do it like that at work obviously and yeah here we go with the milk we want we want to do get a nice whirlpool going and like make minimal sort of screeching noises because no one wants like it's not good for the milk and you know it's not good for the service as well no one wants to hear like screeching milk and yeah I'm going by touch this time so you want want to like keep it swirling keep it frothing until it's sort of just like just hot to touch on the like the outside of the the milk thingy. I don't know the proper name for it. I'll have to look it up. <laughs> but yeah, so milk's done now. Just gonna tap it down a bit to get rid of any excess air bubbles and like... Uh, mug's a bit dirty, Jesus. Sorry about that. <laughs> Alright, so yeah, now I'm just tapping, like just swirling the milk around to try and agitate it and get it folded in. We want a nice want a nice silky texture there and yeah nice nice foam obviously for a cappuccino and yeah when the milk's to a decent standard you just pour it in I only used enough milk for my cup so just kind of get it all in there make sure there's good froth and presto changer cappuccino if you like this video let me know